Hey right guys, Trippy Reacts here and we are back with The Boys Season 4 where of course we've reacted to Seasons 1, 2 and 3 uh, which I love all three of those seasons. I think my favourite out of the three is still Season 2. I don't know. I know most people it's Season 3 uh, but because of mainly Soldier Boy and you had Hero Gasm, which were both of course incredible but I think Season 2 for me is still the peak and it also got confirmed three days ago i think or something that season five so the next season is going to be the final season of the boys which i'm actually quite happy about i, I think this doesn't need to be a show that goes on for eight seasons of them trying to take down homelander because there are already as great as the boys are the boys is uh there are already elements i think especially with season three where it starts to feel a bit okay how many times are we gonna do this kind of thing um, i don't think it's quite crossed that line yet where it does feel repetitive i won't say it's I won't say this is a repetitive show, but I think I'd worry that it would get to that point if it went on for much longer. So I think that they've announced uh, that season five is going to be the final season. I assume this season will kind of build up to some big um, cliffhanger of sorts or something where you like you kind of know that we're going into the last season and then we have like a big showdown in season five. So uh, yeah, I'm happy that it, that got announced. Um, I think five seasons sounds absolutely perfect for a show like this. And we also have like more spin-off shows that are going to be coming out with this world i'm sure we already have gen v uh, which was already really really good and that's got obviously a season two uh, probably coming next year so we have that to look forward to uh, but yeah we have three episodes that have been released today so i'm gonna do episode one today and maybe two and three tomorrow because alongside this we also have the obviously pretty all liars <laughs> original sin penultimate episode and also bridgerton season four part two or season three part two has just come out so i need to do that and then on monday we have house of the dragon and then the following thursday after that we have the bear season three so there's a lot of shows coming out this month and we start with the boys uh, so yeah june's exciting we got a lot of good stuff uh, coming out so yeah episode one guys if you enjoy make sure to leave a like as it does help the video and it does help the channel if you are new to the channel then i have reacted to seasons one no did i yeah i did do season one i did do season one season one two and three as uh, so you can get those on the playlist or just search them up uh but yeah season four let's do this oh patreon I was like, there's something I'm missing. Patreon is linked down below in the description and pinned comment as well if you do want to join us over on there. Now we can go. Episode one. Let's do it. Go on, sir. There he is. Have a bump. <laughs> <laughs> the only recap we need. Commander has agreed to donate to the Starlight no, House. No, which, no. <laughs> I mean, no. But Soldier Boy was my father. No. I love that she was in Gen V. Because <laughs> Gen V, in a way, did feel like the boys 3.5. <laughs> Just like a bit of bonus content with some of the characters. I wonder if Gen V characters will pop up in this, actually. And God bless America! <laughs> Give me a go! Oh, mister. Getting too hard. You need to eat more. You pull this off, I promise. I'll grab all these muscles. So he's got that mustache on now. I can't see shit. Are you helping? Are you just showing off? Oh, for sure, both. Well, thank God we could have just bought a flashlight, but... <laughs> Where the fuck is Butcher? <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, don't you fucking start. I'm fine. Shock you too? Is he talking to imaginary people now? Butcher's definitely going to die by the end of the show. Cover our exit, one. Oh, come off it. What's your fucking thought? Kamiko, if Butcher steps one foot in that elevator, break his arm. Yeah. Well, uh, to be fair, she probably could. <laughs> she definitely could. <laughs> yes, there he is. Homelander is innocent. Just staring at some blank wall. I mean... Oh, no, no. He's just... Yeah, taking a piss. Okay. <laughs> cool. <laughs> and that shot was in the trailer, wasn't it? The grey hair. The grey pube. Ah, oh, kiddo. Would you be scared of a bunch of cockroaches? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Fair, yes. They're only humans. And toys for our amusement. Uh of course, of course. Yeah, yeah. Toys for our amusement. Everyone knows that he did just kill that civilian, didn't don't they? I mean not that anyone can do anything about it, but Do not engage with Homeland. That means you, Butcher, you copy? Yeah, he's definitely not gonna listen to that. This hotel makes its own ice cream. Why don't you take Ryan and try and find some, huh? What a great idea. Go for it, sport. 
Does nobody come back pregnant? <laughs> oh. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. They're too young. Although Brian could spew goo if he wanted to. <laughs> okay. Just. I don't want your support. You're on trial for fucking murder. Oh, okay, he is on trial then. <laughs> that thug threw a projectile on my son. It was a plastic bottle. Could have had anthrax in it. No, no, no. The transaction so you and good. I may or may not have had is ancient history. <laughs> like he was psycho before, I feel like he's just gonna... Once he gets away with this murder, like, and has all the new supporters. <laughs> Girls get it done in the White House. Hmm? God bless you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, she's texting easily. But you know how dangerous Homelander is. He's my dad. Right, he murdered some poor sod right in front of your eyes. Yeah, too early for him to be going. Please, son, I'm begging you. It's what your mum would want. No. Oh, <laughs> he got that so quick. Look at that big black mass curdling around your brain. Oh, okay, that's why he's talking to my imaginary folk. <laughs> what do you got, six months? Less? It's too bad. We're not going to have that last dance together. You better do. Imagine they go the whole show and these two don't have the big 1v1. I mean, they already kind of had, but... <laughs> it's so bad. I do not want to miss Smash Mouth. <laughs> that, that's fair. That is fair. No one wants to miss Smash Mouth. Smash, miss, miss Smash Mouth. Perfect harmony and teach the world to so stop You know what? At least he saw his taxi driver hair cut out. <laughs> What are you doing in here? Apologies, Ms. Newman. We're with your mother's detail. What's Zoe? Doing? What do you know Zoe is? Oh, instantly spotted. Yeah, that mirror really sabotaged you there. <laughs> oh, fucking hell. Damn. Okay, what's happening? She's a fucking soup! She's a fucking soup! That's her power then, I guess. Are they gonna have plot armor here? I mean, Kimiko could just lob her out a window. Jesus! It's okay. What's the law? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Jesus, going for her arm. <laughs> That's cool power. We need an exit. Wow, her arm's already been shredded with like 10 minutes in. Frenchie, trust me. <laughs> the little tiny handle, though. <laughs> Matrix, do you do? If that ain't a Matrix reference, I don't know what is. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Oh, really? Wow. Well, that plan went well. <laughs> She'll be fine, though, no? Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, sorry, mate. Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh, God. Do I, do I really do I need to see? Okay. Christ, can we go now? Hey, Huey. <laughs> hey. You gotta teach Butcher the meaning of the word covert. It just got made by a 12 year old. You shot your own daughter up with V? How could you do that to her? I needed to keep her safe. Safe? You turned her into a fucking monster. Yeah, but she can wreck anyone now. It's, it's kind of cool, so. Like you and me, we were... We were like family. I mean... Wait. Was everything just... Bullshit? I guess you were close, but... You were one of my closest friends. I mean, hell, you're dating a suit. If anyone would understand, it would be you, right? She's got a scary power, because she could just blow your head up within a second. I was scared. I'm scared you'd have to pop my head. I was scared yeah. to lose you. These two are dating in real life, aren't they? I don't know if they still are. Hey, Vicky. Eat my dog. Oh, you. Oh. Yeah. He didn't even have a cool catchphrase. Seriously? That was crap, Huey. I have to be on TV in like 10 that minutes, was fucking crap. asshole. We're gonna out you. I hurt you, you out me. You out me, I killed everyone you've ever loved. The only thing that makes sense is a truce. Okay. Or plan B. <laughs> okay. How is it you guys are actually getting worse at your job? Yeah, that's... That is fair. She's so unfazed. The wars. Great intro. Straight back into it. How you been? Bog. Trying to wash off the stench of failure from your cock up last night. <laughs> Dead at the hands of a 12-year-old. We had to tell their families they snorted fentanyl-laced cocaine at the after party. Did you see their faces? <laughs> Eliminating her is top priority. So do your fucking job. Yes, ma'am. 
Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Somewhere else you need to be. What a ringtone. Billy Butcher. Yes. Jeffrey Dean Morgan. I knew he was in this. Got announced a while ago. I hope he actually has like a lot to play in this season. This is the fourth, fifth show we've seen him in reaction wise. Grey's Anatomy, Supernatural, Walking Dead, Shameless, The Boys. You remember the Pantier Valley? Pretty hard to forget. You dragged me out of there and dropped how many bodies to do it without giving it a second fucking thought. And yet you still didn't name your son after me, eh? <laughs> we need someone like you, baby. Principal didn't say why, just that she KO'd a boy. A boy? Don't you dare be proud right now. She's been slamming doors, Marvin. She Whoa. She told me to eat a dick. Okay, well, that's... She's been having a hard time since Todd moved out. You mean since you kicked him out? Uh, let's dial down the glee in your voice, but yes. Okay, at least she kicked him out. <laughs> it was a nuisance. Todd got so deep into all that weird home teamer shit. He's not answering my calls. I don't know where he is. Okay, so... And you're good at finding people. Yeah, he's part of a call, that guy is 100%. Right? She knows the candle. <laughs> you are simply bad, brother. Ah, uh, good times. Yeah, God. God, Homelander has nightmares. Surprising to no one. Thought and Homelander aren't above the law. They can't just do whatever they want. <laughs> Look at him. Bro. We gotta talk about the octopus in the room. Your ex Cassandra. The octopus in the room. There were no relations with an octopus. It's uh, just a racist rumor and. <laughs> Uh, well, Fez. Uh, emotionally unstable, hysterical woman. Who, let's be clear, pooped in my bed. Deep. Okay. <laughs> noir. Did Noir not die then? I can't, I can't remember his power. I just can't remember. <laughs> He's came back at the end of the last season, didn't he? Talon out of Redlands. Ass. She's a butterface. Her body's on point, but her face. Yeah, I get it. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, that's. Show up, Mr. Prick. <laughs> Ooh, not that slutty cum rag. Okay, great. Oh, I know him. Eat a dog. He ate out a dog. From the 100. And Black Sails. And that's it. That's all he gets. What's her power? She's the world's smartest person. She's not smart enough to know when to shut her mouth. Okay. <laughs> Isn't he a uh... Texas nut job? The San Antonio office had to cover up those migrant murders. I kind of like him. Of course you do. You just said he was crazy. What I meant was we would be crazy to, you know... Not bring him in. Yeah, well, no one does. Go against him. Surrounded by sycophants and fucking imbeciles. It's just that you make a lot of really great points, sir. Deep. <laughs> Blow a train. What? I'm not kidding. Okay. Go over there, pull out a train's cock. Blowing. Oh, why are we doing this? There's no way this happens. There's no way this happened. Like, this is a scene that happens. I refuse to believe. I know people have written fanfic about this as well, so they're probably buzzing. There's no way this happens. Sex is just a spectrum, right, bro? Get off your fucking face. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> Homelander faces his toughest opponent yet. Our corrupt legal system. Smash that donate button, get free tote. Roland Keating uh. attacked Homelander's son. <laughs> The magic of Vought on Ice. I love the ads they do. Yes. Steady. Good. Good. What are they trying to do? Oh, have a flying. Yes. Oh. Annie. Oh, yeah. I didn't realize she was like flying in the first scene. Oh, yeah. His dad's Simon Pegg. And then Simon Pegg disappeared for two seasons. All right. I'm out of here. Recycling bin, motherfucker. <laughs> oh. Damn. Oh, this was in Gen V, I think. The end of Gen V. I think I can handle myself. Oh, you mean that nasty little virus they cooking up at Godolkin? Now I know about it. And I know it ain't strong enough to kill Homelander. Yet. Well, yet. We ain't killing him till the next season. Motherfucker, I just logged in five minutes ago. What's happening? <laughs> this shit. Uh, okay, yeah, you gotta hit keep me logged in. Sorry. Uh, yeah, keep me logged in, but, uh... Yeah, first. Spoiler alert, that will not keep you logged in. Also, yeah, true. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, Simon Pegg, Dad. Fuck! Kid, 
is being groomed and thrown into Starlight's LGB terror dungeon. Child life. Okay. Be a lot easier to get media coverage if you were there. Oh, he's watching. Our own people are going to betray her. I want to help, of course, but as Annie January. No one's donating to the Annie house. It sounds like we sell raisin cookies. That's actually fair. Oh, I'm looking out. What the fuck? He's collecting them. Of course he is. What other secrets he's got in this apartment? <laughs> Just home that they're repairing it, you know. I am almost never surprised. I come in. What the hell? We'll see what I'm in. I in Homelander. Oh my god. Sister Sage. Just Sage. Right. Vought added the sister part. Can't have one of us without a racial qualifier. <laughs> yeah, well. You know, I would have thought the smartest woman on earth would have a nicer place. Smartest person. And that person's too smart to give a fuck about Pottery Barn. Okay. Preach, sister. <laughs> it's God's sake. <laughs> Based on your public appearances, your stylist is dyeing your hair more often. Used to be every month, now it's every 2.4 weeks. Oh, Did she no. tell you you're glowing gray or is she hiding? So between that and your enlarged prostate. My fucking what? I look at your hands. You've been washing them more often, so likely you've been peeing more often. Is that even being intelligent? That's just... We do age. Plus, there's that small American oh, yeah, that... father almost killed you. <laughs> wow. So they just got out wait just wait till he dies of old age, no? You are welcome to laser me. But I'm guessing you need me in my party tray for something. Yeah, that's, she got you on that one. Breathe the word of this. Pull you apart bit by bit. Of Natural. course. Yeah. <laughs> I've spent my life. Humans are nothing. They're they're less than nothing. They're just toys for my amusement. And yet <laughs> his little phrase. What kind of legacy am I, am I gonna leave? To my son, a, a shithole country and a shithole world, or something better, something pure, cleansed. <laughs> like... Okay, is he gonna just just destroy the whole world? That's his big plan. Tell me how you'd go about it, hypothetically. Be careful here. <laughs> just gotta nudge him a little, then you get to swoop in, be the one saving it. Well, like Caesar. Like Caesar. Wasn't it? This is in the trailer, this little bit of dialogue. Bro wants to become Caesar. Plus, I'm a black woman who is a thousand times smarter than you. Your ego can't handle it. <laughs> I'm pretty smart myself. See what I mean? Smart enough to listen. Hey, mm, well, okay. I mean, really listen to you. And you can stay here, reeking of Taco Bell and loneliness. <laughs> or... You can put some of your theories into To be fair, I do think he actually wants someone who won't just go along with everything he's saying. His other seasons and other episodes wouldn't give you that impression, but I think based on this episode, that's kind of what I'm thinking. But again, say the wrong thing, he probably will kill you, so. He, he called me right before it happened, and um, I didn't pick up. Why didn't I pick up? Because your dad's boring. I hope the old man pulls through. <laughs> a hug from Butcher, what? Oh, there we go. <laughs> can never just be, with Butcher and Huey, can never just be something nice, can it? Colin. Colin Creevy. I do love these two. I feel like forward a little bit in season three with him though. I don't know, we'll see. Oh, they found him. That was easy. I mean, Kimi Kimiko was amazing in season three, so. It's gonna be a whole ass call. Oh, it's her. You recognize her? Sage. Not sure. He's here, right? Like in the building here? This is the best day of my life. Oh my god, mate. Yeah. Good timing. Hey, train, try these Buffalo Ranch bacon blasters. They're juicy. Sage. Well, they got like a fan meetup going on. What the fuck are you doing here? Homelander's tired of being surrounded by morons. 
Hello, everyone. Homelander. What did he have to spit out? I heard that you are some of my biggest fans supporting me. <laughs> He's buzzing. I just wanted to personally say thank you. Well, really, it's you who gives so much to... You people are more <laughs> than just fans. You're martyrs. Oh, my God. Oh, ah. That's... I want you to take these bats and beat these gentlemen to death. Oh, okay. What? Why? <laughs> you funny. Oh, it's like one of your tests. No, I don't I don't think this one is. I don't think this one is. Not a test. I want you to beat these gentlemen to death. You get Jeffrey Dean Morgan in the episode and you have to, to pull out a baseball bat scene, really. I mean, you don't want the deep Maybe doing it. Yep, yep. You want no one to do it, I want it. Because at least it's done. Okay, deep cover. Yep. Cool. Yeah, you're done, mate. Okay, damn! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, that's him done. And I thought he was just going... I mean, he was kind of going to a cool bit, but look what happened. Yo, what the... Fuck, that was so fucked up, you guys. What the hell? Is that not the noir we know, then? This is like a... Okay, cool. Yeah, I might sound ridiculous. I need a reminder of how the noir thing works. Are you ready to stop reusing your catheter and start living your life? <laughs> <laughs> Very important message, yeah. Starlight Jersey Army. Any second. Oh, here we go. How has she got here so quick? What the hell? Not guilty! Oh, yeah. She's gonna throw it. You fascist! Yep. Wow! <laughs> Just disappearing to the background. I don't think we'd find out his sentence this episode as well, but. Damn. <laughs> Who the hell's Colin? I'm. Oh, mate, was he in um, his flashback episode? I think maybe. Because we had French's past for one of the episodes. I'm okay. I'm okay. I think that's who this is. If it's not, then it feels so random. <laughs> Just throw this character in there, but. Damn. One way to get rid of the bodies. He's loving it. Everyone remain calm. <laughs> <We're all very laughs> <special people. laughs> yeah, don't get too involved. Bloody hell. Could have been a worse landing, it's not bad. We can fight, but not like this. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, damn. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> This broke a leg. Gosh. Oh, okay. yeah. Help! Oh, now. Oh, okay. Okay. That's why they were killed. He knows they weren't there when they died, though. Yep, smart world. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sage already coming into play. Oh, eyes on Sage. <laughs> Just drinking his milk. <laughs> you gonna finish that? Oh, come on, buddy. We're supposed to be celebrating. <laughs> the glass of milk. <laughs> oh. What's wrong? Celebrate, celebrate with your old dad. <laughs> glass of milk. I don't want Butcher to die. And all those things he said about you. He said mm. awful, awful things about you. Just horrible. My mom loved him. Well, what about you? Oh, he's <laughs> fuming. <sighs> War was right. It was so fucked up. You have every right to be upset. What he was talking to is it the octopus that he uh, got rid of? Could vanish under the waves forever. Yeah, I've probably got some Everyone secret compartment. You for you, as the sweet, sensitive, really strong swimmer you are. Look at me. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there it is. Maybe. Piece is so gonna die. We wouldn't have to hide our love anymore. <laughs> we could just be. Does I want to ship these two? The music. You know, so anyway, lots to talk about. Uh, give me a call. I'll love you some. So 
I, I read, correct me if I'm wrong, but originally they wanted to film the boys years ago and Simon Pegg was meant to pay, play Huey, but then he got too old to play Huey. Mom? Mom? The hell? You promised me you would take care of Ryan. Oh, yeah. Bloody hell. What do you think I'm trying to do here? I think you're about to fuck over Huey. This is who he's been talking to, though. And it's going to blow up in your face. Again. Look, I saved the kid at the tower, didn't I? Quinn from Tree Hill. Man died a long time ago. It's too late. I'm out of time. Clay Jensen. Oh, this is what she wanted. Oh, what the hell? What? <laughs> well, I hope you're happy now. Oh, for God's sake. Dying aloud on YouTube. Shocker. Great first episode. I don't know if it's just because, like, when I, I think when I went into season three, I can't remember if I'd watched season one and two kind of close to it. So I felt like I'd just seen a lot of the boys. Um, whereas this kind of more feels like, oh, it's been a while since I've seen the boys. So maybe that's why I'm a bit more, oh, this was a great episode. But yeah, I really enjoyed this. I think there's some things in there I'm not sure. Like, I'm not sure why we've got Colin in the show, like Frenchie hooking up with Colin. Uh, I don't know. Again, I've not rewatched seasons one, two, and three, so I don't know if there's some details I'm missing, but I think he was in the flashback um, or something like that. Or if they've mentioned him, I don't remember who he is. But yeah, I'm not sure where that's going. I won't say it's a bad thing. I'm just curious where it's going. Um, we got Huey's dad is in the hospital from a coma, so that's kind of like, I guess, well, it did feel a bit random that like Simon Pegg was in the first episode of the show and then. I think he showed up one other time in season two or three, and then that was it. Uh, so at least they've got him back in some way just to show, like, oh, he does still exist, and then Hugh's mum is showing up as well. So there's hopefully something going to be going on about that, and it's not just Simon Pegg has a coma, and we'll, we'll see where it leads. Uh, but everything with Starlight was really good. Everything with Homelander was obviously great. Butcher, we've got Jeffrey Dean Morgan in there. Uh, and then uh, kind of coming back into it with uh, tracking down... Sage, so Sage seems like a pretty interesting character. He's kind of got the, you know, he knows that they didn't die there, that they were somewhere else when they died. So he's kind of caught onto that. Um, who else? A lot of good side characters. Like getting the D back in there is just he's hilarious and ridiculous, but he's so funny. Uh, Kamiko was great. Um, yeah, all the characters that I love still pretty great in this episode. And like I say, I don't know if it is because I just haven't seen the boys in a, in a couple of years now that I've missed it, but I thought this was really great episode and great way to start things off so i'm gonna go an eight out of ten for this episode i think we could, i'm gonna jump straight into episode two actually i was gonna do episode two and three tomorrow but i, well, I want to watch episode two and see what happens next so yeah thanks for watching guys leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe if you're new as like i said we'll get reactions to every single episode of the boys i think it's gonna be eight eight episodes as usual so we'll do a reaction to every episode and we've got house of the dragon the bear uh bridgerton as well so a lot of shows coming out this month, like I said. But yeah, I'll see you next time for episode two. Until then, take care. Peace.